And you can have all the pudding you want. I don't have to eat my beans first? Not today. Oh. Uh -huh. He said he's about hey, to give it up. Hammer. What's going on? It's your boy Sinte with the Intel, and you can already see Rakai is in the building. What's going on, champion? Hello, governor. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. This is Batman Caped Crusaders. Episode four really took a big turn in a positive direction. Make sure you check that episode out if you mm -hmm. haven't. If it's your first time joining. You make sure you stay to the very end because, you know, me and Rakai, we're going to chop it up. Have a bit of a back and forth, if you will, over things we've enjoyed and the things that, you know, we may be scratching our heads over. So without any further ado, let's get started. You know, I was saying at the end of the last episode that about some of the different rogues gallery that yeah. we might see. The but there were several the that left off, and I think fight. Batman has probably the most the recognizable star. rogues gallery of, of yeah. villains. You know, him and Spider-Man probably have... Insolent peasant, unhand me! I am your mm. king, and you will do as he I say! He talks my language, you insolent <laughs> peasant! <laughs> Get your hands unhand off me! Unhand me, you cad! <laughs> yes. Unhand me, fiend. I think I'm gonna call somebody an insolent peasant today. <laughs> Is that Fletcher Deming, the real estate baron? I saw him at a party a few months ago. He seemed perfectly fine. Now he's locked up in Arkham. Arkham? Oh, yeah, man. Cuckoo. Apparently, a few weeks ago, he donated his entire fortune to charity. He always seemed like such a selfish man. Perhaps I was wrong. You weren't. <laughs> hmm. He said, nah, you ain't wrong. Mm -hmm. You weren't. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is an awful way oh to die. Gosh. Sometimes I just feel so hopeless about this city. Like it's past the point of saving. You've got to learn to laugh it off. Mm. So many nights I'd go home feeling just like you do now. And laughing helps that and saw you two outside mind if i join yeah you're right their their character design is very similar it's too similar i'm worried about your dad mm -hmm. ever since the mayor put flas and bullock in charge of the task force it's like it changed their nose color their lipstick but will you talk to him i can try but i really wouldn't know what to say let's role play no <laughs> he'll be okay i hope you're right Keep your chin up, Barbie. Gotham needs you. They got uh, Montoya, though, awful blocky built. She looked like she played linebacker for the, for the New yeah. York Giants. Yeah. It's sweet the way you worry about the commissioner. Her dad's more of a father to me than mine ever was. Hmm. But I guess that's back in the day. They had them shoulder pads and them Come suit jackets. Come on, shimmy sometimes. Tomorrow night. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, yeah. I can make that work. Good. Then it's a date. Oh. Well, see, like in the comics, if I remember correctly, Doctor Montoya got down like ah. that. Though. Like she was, she was one of them gals that okay. liked them gals. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen, we must have representation <laughs> across, across all, all the spectrum. The... That man gave 1.5 billion and signed it to King Tut. He was like, nah, that's BS. I'm a billionaire, and I know I would never. Yeah. <laughs> so Bruce yeah. Wayne was like, nah. I was say, uh, Bruce Wayne need to be on lookout. Somebody going, you know what I'm saying, him him up. Oh. Wow. This dude done opened the wrong, you know, opened the Raiders of the Lost Ark or something. Oh, to Dr. Harley Quinn, huh? Mm. I told you. Mm. It's like, boy, stop. Right Y'all get some of this. Yeah, some of this no no juice. He already out. He come here and get this. Yup, yup. About to get the beats. Mm. Mm -hmm. You already been pieced up a couple times by the bat. Yeah. He didn't got the Roscoe <laughs> out here pointing. Look. He ain't even, he ain't even bothered him. Oh, they're chattel. And now they want to unionize. After everything I've done for them. Call them chattel, day. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's... I don't deserve this. They're worse than my children. He said, how dare they want a union and want, like, fair pay and... <laughs> 
medical benefits. How dare they? <laughs> but these yes. sessions, they are really yeah. helping. Sick days. Hmm? But I don't. I don't think we're making any progress at all. Oh. Hey, what is this? You're a real menace to society, Emerson. I've tried to get you to see the humanity in your employee. Mm. This must be them extra sessions that uh, Bruce wasn't going to pay for. Oh. Think it's time to ratchet things up a bit. Huh. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh -oh. I thought it was going to be a, a moment that made her change. She's just been crazy. Patient doing this morning. Wow. I can't run anymore, please. Now, now. If you're not bleeding, you're not working hard enough. Isn't that what you said huh? to your son? Dang. Yeah, get you some. And you can't make me! Is that so, Mr. Belsky? I want dessert! Such a child. But that was always your problem. Mm. Oh. You're gonna get out of being in the big back club. <laughs> Welcome to my inpatient facility, Mr. Collins. I call it the playpen. Mm. I'll have your head on a spike for this. The tables have turned, mm. Mr. Collins. How do you think that was gonna get him out? Run this court anymore. The jester does. Hastings, mm. please release Mr. Belsky from his cell. So she's not in her, her signature colors no. yet. What's going on? Belsky, would you like some dessert? Oh, okay. She brought the hammer out early. Let's go. And you can have all the pudding you want. I don't have to eat my beans first. Not today. Uh -huh. He said he's about to give it up. Give him the big old hammer. Listen, do you understand how big my back is? I'm getting ready to get that pudding. <laughs> pudding. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Putin. Putin. <laughs> mm -hmm. And this is how old I am. I remember that that microfiche technology. Yeah, microfiche. <laughs> yeah. Tycoon died three years yeah. ago. Penning. We too old. We know Dewey Decimal. Yeah. <laughs> Kids nowadays ask what rap group that is. Who would be able to convince some of Gotham's greediest men to give away all their worldly possessions? A therapist. Hmm. Mm. That was a lot of money back in the 40s. Mm-hmm. $150 a pop? Mm -hmm. Hell, that's a lot of money for me today. <laughs> Quinn. Do you know her? I don't know. I, her name feels so good in my mouth. <laughs> Miss Gordon. That is a strange ah, thing to say. Oh, oh, you know with the Kyrie? <laughs> <laughs> Dang, anybody can get these shoulders. Oh, he's on the Jerome Bettis plane. Yo. Listen, the wheels on the bus go <laughs> round and round. I'm impressed with Barbara doing all this in heels. Oh. Oh, he about to take that jump, Oh, he's he? going off. I'm yeah. coming! <laughs> oh, oh, that is one strong piece of fabric right oh, there, boy. Man. See her! I need to be with her! See who? Who do you... Harley got that good good. Tell me her name. Ha, ha, uh, Harley. Mm. That's some fast working go go juice right there, boy. Oh, that's great. So give me the skinny. What kind of food right. does she like? You see how she um, I've run into her direction. That joint? No. Yeah. I've got one. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying? Did she, did she recognize, did she pick up on the fact that she was lying? Mm. When the evidence is pointing you in a direction, you don't want to look. The truth is always better than the alternative. At least this. Mm -hmm. mm. Renee thinks you need a day off. I know that. She has a point. Not going to happen, kid. He is just scribbling on them pages. The Batman. You got in the safe, got all of that. Got you, damn it. Got you ain't knowing. That's old school uh -huh. right there. Uh -huh. 
Man, these kids don't know nothing about that. That's old school right there. <laughs> Man, that's back in the good old days when you read uh, Hardy Boys and Nancy Drew <laughs> Mysteries type. Old school right there, boy. Oh, we. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you did. <laughs> A little bit of dating. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. William Hastings? What's this regarding? It's personal. I am William Hastings. Oh. Hmm. I'm representing Fletcher Deming, and I know you were both patients of Dr. Quinzel. Isn't Dr. Quinzel's client list confidential? Mm. I checked your office, and nobody's seen you in months, so I was worried that- This is a wild invasion of privacy. I demand you leave the property immediately. Oh. I mean, he's right. You know you're gonna let it go. That's not Ivis at all. No one would see that. I'm gonna go back and see him in a diaper. <laughs> Sucking his thumb. <laughs> mm-hmm. Go back to the city. I'll handle Quinzel. Wait. Mm. That is not fair. <laughs> really? Wait. That's not what it's really called. No, not at all, but next time, maybe I'll take you to the skating rink and I'll let you call them whatever you want. Oh, oh, Kobe, shoot that shot, uh, huh? I'm sucking now. Oh. They brought the whole long cord. Girl, girl, you busted. I know your okay. secrets. Like the house phone in the kitchen. Long cord. <laughs> Be right there. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. There's an emergency with the patient. Oh. I bet. Meet me later at Hopper's on Wilson and Lowry. We'll pick up where we left off. Oh. She's like, I'm closing you. Oh, mm -hmm. sucking the oh, and she closed she's her like, eyes. Closing you. Tonight. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I don't even know what it's called. It's not clapping of cheeks, but <laughs> it's something with cheeks. Why is Batman walking like that? That is weird. Charlie can really have some for the body. Mm -hmm. I knew you'd come for me. Oh, she got dressed up and everything. Mm -hmm. She had time to go make her outfit change. Look how she got these dudes in outfits, though. Me very happy, and whoever doesn't is dead. Oh, she had the tools ready. Is that a cricket bat? Yeah, I mean, that is... <laughs> We didn't watch a bunch of series that that is the preferred tool of the discerning uh, bad guy. All she's waiting is for, for Batman to duck off in one of them little rooms. She's going to close the door on him. Mm. If you don't get your... Oh. He's out here in the depends. And I you're told closed you. in. Time to be studied. Told you. I knew it. I know it got him. And here comes the juice. Here comes the, yep. Yeah. Oh, nothing. Mm. I don't want to kill you, but I need to give myself a head start so your hero complex doesn't bite me in the hind. Mm. You've got a few minutes to figure your way out before the house blows. Quinzel. Gabe. We can unpack some of that childhood trauma. Five minutes, boss. She's, she's a G. Mm. I'm about to say, don't. Mm, mm, mm. Are you going to Miss Gotham now? Just drive. Barbara. Yup. Barbara. Mm -hmm. But now! What'd she do with her guns? She had been staying with this bat for the last three minutes. This place is gonna blow. Harleen, what have you done? I'll answer all your questions later, but we gotta go now. We're not leaving without him. All uh, right, you didn't broke it. First boomy. Uh-oh. Mm. I mean, that's a nice crib. She was getting paid, paid. Oh. Oh. The whole thing just fell off in. The... 
Now, I wonder if this is where Barbara gets got. Ah, uh, because she does Because, you know, get in the comics, the comics stuff, Barbara's yeah. in, a, in a wheelchair. Yep. Oh. You know how much arm strength, you know what I'm saying? Like, you couldn't miss no days in the gym do it right there. I can pull you up. Girl. I'm not going ah. to prison or Arkham. Mm. Ah, well, apparent. Okay. So you happen to gain yeah, consciousness, yeah, know where you are. I happen to wake up while my, and get out while of my that room thing. is falling off the cliff. That yeah. <laughs> and so, <laughs> oh, sure. Your friendship with Dr. Quinzel made you reckless. You should have left when shut I... Shut up. Just mm. shut up. Ain't nobody trying to hear told you so my right now. My best friend just died. Yeah. On top of the fact, I just found out my, my best friend was a whole villain out this piece. I you gotta go. have to go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. How about thank you? <laughs> hmm. Seems like better get stood up. It's Harley. My bad, boo. Mm. Little Outside change of plans. Pudding. Harleen. If you're watching this on YouTube, you're gonna see a cut down version of our reaction because we're only allowed to show you a limited amount of picture in picture. But if you wanna watch the whole thing with us uncut, uninterrupted, head over to our Patreon page at patreon.com forward slash Sintel. Become a member of this channel. You'll get access to the full uncut reaction, but you will need your own Netflix, HBO Max, or Disney Plus subscription. So you can open up each episode in an adjacent window to our reaction. We'll give you a little time with a small reference video at the bottom of the screen to help you sync up the footage. And it'll be like you're watching it with your favorite pals from the internet. Well, she says she'd nice. be back. So, you know, I mean, we'll of course she'll goes. be back, but. <laughs> All right, um, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I was not expecting, you know, Harley Quinn's, you know, mm -hmm. persona to kind of like come out so, so quickly. I thought there was gonna be like a thing, like a trigger that made her you know, turn a little crazy because in the original, you know, in the original animated series, right. you know, Joker kind of like turned her from his mm -hmm. hijinks. And I think in the, I think in the comic as well, I'm sure Pierce will, will, will correct me in the chat that there was like a triggering incident, right? So there, we didn't get that. She was just like, no. nah, you know, I've just uh -huh. been, I've just been kind of a little, little cuckoo from, from the word go. I do appreciate them saving time because we addressed last episode that we kind of jumped into the trope super early regarding some of Batman, especially comes with his parenting. So they didn't want to waste no time when it came to Hardy Quinn. So I do, I do appreciate that. I'm still trying to process the suit um, because, you know, I'm so used to the, to the old red, black and white. Um, uh, it's just, you know, it's just an adjustment. You know, it took me a hot second to get adjusted in the first episode to some things. I think it's going to be that way with seeing the harley quinn's final form how are you feeling about this episode uh i don't know uh how i feel about this retcon of harley quinn okay um because for one harley quinn is one of the characters and i may be wrong and i'm sure that someone in the chat who's a dc stan will correct me but i'm pretty sure that harley quinn came from Batman the animated series or one of the other animated series. Yes. And then went into the comics and became canon. Mm. She she was originated in the uh in animated form. And because she became so popular, that's what pushed her over into comics and then live action. Mm. Um so this retcon of because if you heard when she was talking to uh Barbara Gordon you know, she was just saying, you know, in my sessions, the, you know, the stuff I hear and the greed and blah, 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 you know, was that seems to be her trigger. I, I don't know. I prefer the Joker being her trigger. I mean, this is, it is what it is. Um, however, this calls back to what we just said the last episode too, that she's also the first one that got away. Yeah. You know, yeah. he's caught everybody else, including Selena Kyle, which, you know, so she actually got away. So we may see um, her return later, um, maybe in a more traditional form that we've seen her in with uh, 
being the sidekick to sidekick to the clown of crime. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised uh, because, you know, th things they are changing. I can't see Harley Quinn being a sidekick anymore. Um, I think, especially with the new live action versions of her with everything from, what is it, Birds of Prey to her being in the Suicide Squad, her having her own thing. Like, she's kind of like her own woman now. And I, and I think for her to go back to sidekick status, I think it would just be an uproar. So I, I and, and and because of the nature of the times, I think they're going to make her kind of like maintain that, including the the Harley Quinn animated series, which is something I highly recommend to anybody oh. who is who has not participated in HBO's version. It's 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 glorious. Ten out of ten. Yeah, it's glorious. It is. Uh, this Harley Quinn is very different from any of those other renditions. This one is a little is, is a lot more serious, um, a little more a little more scary ish as compared to the yeah, other she's ones. Dark. Yeah, yeah, and it's okay. Like I said, it's, it's just gonna it's just gonna take a second to kind of get used to it. I don't, I'm not mad at the decision. It's just gonna take a second. Um, I think uh, you know it's still this. It's still um, uh, not as high as the previous episode of episode four, but it's still on an upward track. Mm -hmm. It's still we're, we're at this yeah. point we're we're invested. You know, it's it's full investment. We're five episodes in. Um, so even if I even if we weren't doing this as a um, as a part of uh, the the channel, I would still continue watching. I, I still think it's it's, uh, it's good quality, and based off of some of the reviews that I've seen, you know, it's it's getting some pretty good remarks. Uh, I don't really have anything of note other to other than one other like ridiculous moment, and that is um, when Batman falls out of the cell that he's locked in. He's able to gain consciousness, break out, fly free, and grab Barbara. That was now. I know I have to yeah, suspend that's... my disbelief when it comes to these shows. I get it, but. That that one was a bit of a stretch. So that's my that's my only yeah. small gripe. Anything you want to close out with? Um, yeah, because I'm just uh, the one thing that I think I'm not liking right now. Okay. Um. So, first, I agree with your point about Harley Quinn. I don't think that they'll make her a sidekick. Hmm. And maybe that was the reason for her retcon. I think that they'll make her her own woman. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that means in relation to the Joker post this. Mm -hmm. But I think my my only gripe right now is that we have a villain of the week. Mm, okay. And I don't like I don't like that per se a villain of the week. This villain of the episode because he seems to catch him every episode. Like by this time, Har uh, Arkham should be bursting at the seams, you know. And you think about. The other villains we have yet to see, you know, your Bane, Talia Al Ghul, mm -hmm. Poison Ivy, King Croc, you know, Captain Boomerang, you name him. He's got a long list of rogues, but to be eight to ten episodes per season, it can't be villain of the week. They do something, he catch them, he throw them in Arkham. Like, that's probably the, the saving grace of this episode that Harley Quinn managed, you know, uh, to escape. You know to return another day or whatever um i would like to see at this point some episodes that are like two parters or whatever mm. so if they don't get caught in one episode let's you know make it two or something like that they're not super long so let's do something like that but let's switch it up just a bit um so that's my only gripe right now you know it's, you got a lot of low level uh, or not even low level. I mean, he's caught some some major people as far as his rose gallery, and he seems to catch them so easily yeah. with this low tech stuff. Like, I don't, I don't know. okay, no, I think that's fair. I'm wondering what you all are thinking in the chat. We are officially. I thought it was 12 episodes this season. But it's actually 10. So we are now officially at the halfway point. What are your thoughts regarding the first half? Uh, of this season uh, and a good place to kind of chop that up and discuss outside of just the comment section here is to check out the discord it's free it's the channel's discord and we talk about all kinds of other projects a big one is doctor who and and includes everything from the house of the dragons to to this to boys uh, yeah the bear <laughs> i mean we got all type stuff on there and it's free 99 free 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 so go and head over there and join the conversation <laughs> Now, if you've been enjoying the conversation that me and Rakai have been having, especially Rakai's side of things, because me, I'm kind of a busy, ah, na, 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 and then I kind of keep it going. Uh, the great thing about Rakai is he tells me, you're like, ooh, slow all that down and look at this thing. And I'll be like, 
all right, I'm gonna look. And I look and I, and he's like, no, I'll look at it from this angle. And I'll be like, huh, that is what you're going to get from Rakai's channel. A very cool and interesting way of looking at some of your favorite media. And not only uh, are you gonna look at it from a different way, you're gonna see it from a very personalized way that Rakai brings. Rakai, tell the people how they get in contact with your channel. Uh, what he's referring to is that I have a dark, twisted, beautiful mind. <laughs> and no, I'm not Kanye. <laughs> Wouldn't want to be. Only his bank account. <laughs> anyway, um, I do sort of look at these things with a different lens. And I do a deep dive on some of the series and uh, movies that we have watched together. And a few that I watched on my own and kind of throw in my own personal little stories in with some of the tropes and themes that we um, reflect on um, in each one of these episodes. So if you like that sort of thing, come visit me at youtube.com forward slash noop from the Ville, N-U-P-E-F-R-O-M-D-A-V-I-L-L-E, -L -L -E, because it's got to be all about this right here. But you really got to use this right here. Thank you, Chef. Thank you, Chef. Hey, thank y'all so much for your time. Can't wait to see y'all in the comments and we'll catch you on the next episode. All right, y'all. Take care. Peace.